Anyways, before I start my stream, I actually want to disclaim you guys. There is something you guys and girls should watch or need to understand now. There's, uh, first of all, I actually want to, uh, um, first of all, before we go for this uh, hunt, I actually want to uh, share with you guys some inf uh, some uh, some codes that are recently going on. So, if you haven't heard about this new special code, you should probably do it right now. Um, there's currently a limited time only code, and I'm gonna give you guys a heads up, a head start before you know you guys and girls that missed a chance. So you have to basically do in the code section on the store, which I have no idea by then. Well, I had to realize that before uh, yesterday. Then you know I have to check it out obviously from there. But yeah, so. From the code, you have to receive uh, receive uh, the type in basically swim with me, but you have to change the I to a one, and then once you've done that, you can redeem it, and then you basically will get it. There's a little funny little saddle with this little funny vari, which is probably someone has not noticed this, but uh, this little vari has been behind me ever since then. Yeah, a little bit confused, but that's okay. So once you've done that, you have received a basically you're gonna be receiving a special saddle, which is gonna be obviously the variety of saddle, which will pop up on the screen, and as well as this little mini bari as well with it. So once you've done that, you can pretty much go into the saddle, which is gonna be kind of weird, which doesn't really make sense of a saddle, but it is what it is. And basically, you turn to this jet uh, this jet boat and. Uh, it looks uh, kind of cool. It also has a little mini sharpoo with that last one. But anyways, so this is what it actually looks like. You can pretty much uh, surf this thing everywhere, even on land and even on water, surprisingly. I don't know how this fairy works or logic goes in. But anyways, that's that. And I hope you enjoyed this little small video here. Not sure if this one I'm really going to include too much, give it too much views or not. But either way, that's just a little in, a little information before we move on to the, today's uh, you know beginning of this, my video here. It's just a small one. I have a bigger one to go through, and see you guys then. Peace. So yeah, there we go. 13 token wasted. Well, that's weird, but okay. So, so let's get to it. So, last time on the stream, I said before I was gonna ask uh, most of the most likely the viewers on my last video. Oh, actually, not sure if I actually did say it, but I said on that one that I'm gonna be doing a special hunt. Now, for this hunt, I'm gonna be have to going for making a decision of either um, the glassier one, the kind of. Or the Arceus one, sort of. I don't know what exactly which. Ver I don't really know what their names are based on, but it's just something with glass and then RC, something like that. So most likely, I'm probably gonna go with the ones that I like the more, and that's gonna be Glacieri, or the little ice type one. So in the future, if there's a chance I'll be making a run, I might pull up a uh, Alpha Gleaming one over here, and maybe try catch one of these again. And maybe I can make a full team of them, but in the future, that could be something for a future video that happens. But I'm going to be going for this one because I think I like this one a little bit better off than the other one. So we'll be back in about a few minutes here once um, once I get it, obviously. Now, this is a raw software setup one, so this one's going to not take that long, I'm pretty sure. Well, maybe, obviously. So obviously, if you haven't seen the, um, obviously this uh, roaming... It's basically it's a, a frozen one and uh, the other one's like a glassed one around them. I'm forgetting almost frozen and a glass one basically. Well, take a look at that's what maybe that's what's around them. But anyways, so all I'm gonna do is just go to it and then pretty much start the hunt. But I'm gonna start for 50 minutes first before we can move into the next few minutes in case I don't wanna you know because I don't have to go. Well, then again, if I go to the, I can always go to the navigate and then go from there. So you can always uh, continue from there worse. But yeah, let's do it. So I have a lot of boost tokens, so what we just got to do is go for uh, front of it, and uh, pretty much it. So let's uh, we'll see you guys and girls once I'm back with uh, a random uh, alpha gleaming one. Also, I'm not sure if I want to get the nimble one, but in case I do, here it is. So let's I guess we'll just go for that one, and see you a bit once I once I got it. So there's our first encounter, 
and we're back once we're done. So there it goes. Now we have the first encounter. Now let's reset. What are you doing, Duskit? This one is nimble, am I right? I'm actually double checking that one. No, this one's brawny. Whoops. And I'm definitely gonna have to do some point in the future. Definitely a, a theme team and also a sweep with each one of those. But I'm um, probably gonna have to go for the misprint or the not misprint, the alpha gleaming one, before I do any of that. Uh, less than how many was that? Five? Oh no! I didn't bring. Oh, I didn't bring Gickle in this one. Oops. Oh no, I didn't bring any spare users actually, not to think about it. What am I doing? Uh, whoops. <sighs> I started this battle badly. <laughs> you know what? This would be even a bigger challenge, so I'm hoping I can get this one without too much issue. How can I start a hunt without a Gekla and a spare user? But then again, this one has slumber, so that would also heal itself, wouldn't it? This one lives. Well, alright, uh, let's go for that one. Not a crit or something. That's kind of a broken uh, move, almost. Don't you think? All right, let's go. Uh, let's just try uh, throwing a uh, one of those frost disc. I will definitely look. It is frost type, right? Isn't it? Oh, almost got it, almost. Alright. Bruh, is this thing gonna stall me with slumber? Oh no! Well, that means that, that means that. Oh wait, so that means there was no point of me getting a spare or or tase or anything like that, wasn't there? Because it's gonna keep stalling me, isn't it? So the best thing you can do is just ace this uh, thing. I'm pretty sure. That's why people are just gonna. Okay, well that makes sense. Okay, well I'm gonna just try my frost disc captures to see if I can get him in a couple times, and hopefully. This thing doesn't stall me, because if this thing stalls me too much time, I'm going to have to ace this thing, because I'm already wasting boost. And that doesn't because I'm wasting on it because of an uh, unpurposed reason. It's just, like, come on now. It's just, this is not going to be a battle of fun. Like, And also, I should probably also use Provoke. The, the, this claimant people, use Provoke. Whenever you hunt for this thing, have a <laughs> something with Provoke. Finish my Vesper 2. I'm okay with that. <gasps> oh, okay, good. Okay, okay, good, good. It's low on HP. Why would you not get in?
Come on. Three shake it. Oh no, it's gonna keep using enough frost beam, isn't it? Oh no. If I love okay, this is only options. If I lose one if okay, Swolder's last option, so Swolder is obviously gonna be able to withstand the hits a little bit. But the question is, should I risk it all the way? So I think I'm gonna do is if Swolder goes down and there's like no option now for me to even try yeah, I'm just gonna keep using that. And uh, now it's gonna be okay, so if Solder goes down, I'm gonna have to ace this thing. I don't care. I have to do it. I have to do it. Possibly it's just worst decision ever, but just remember what I did to the Mudagon on the Gamma one. I have no choice. And did I just misclick on a Blossom disc? How did I miss a click on you? I didn't mean to click on that. Boom. Yes! Boom. Got it. Ladies and gentlemen, we had caught a gleaming Glassidia. And sadly, that is it for that one. And let's see the... It's a terrible one, but whatever. I always take them no matter what. Doesn't matter. Yep, yeah, I'll take it. Nope, no names. So Glassia will be transferred. And now it'll also be the Dusk Gate now. Glassia, as well as the other uh, creature, can now be found roaming in the wild. Wait, so you can get them both? Okay, so I'm guessing you can only obtain one of them as a uh, resettable one, but the other you can't. So there we go, so let's see here. So we got that, and I guess that's the end of that little pathway to whatever this thing goes. And it's so far, it looks like the other one that I'm seeing, let me give it a look, I think... It should be also gone. So I'm trying my. I'm gonna try to get my get there as fast as I can, and I'm probably gonna go to the um, just any uh, resorter quickly as I can, so I don't have to waste boost token. Which, by the way, this needs to be a pause. Like clearly, this area should have a pause thing, but it still wastes boost. Like, what is this going on here? Let me double check. Come on! 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 Yeah, it's free now, so it's not there. So anyways, let me quickly uh, try and go to the the scam resort so I don't have to waste boost as well as check out my team while I'm doing it. So, uh, yeah. I'm probably going to, uh, you know, train up this thing at some point. I mean, I know there's only the range attacking type set, that's for sure, but why do I have to be dull? I mean, okay, I'm okay with that, but whatever. So I'm supposed to remove that and also bring put it back my older uh, teammates because I'm pretty sure some of them don't need to be any more equipped or it'd be in my adventure anymore. Like submarine, that's for sure. Uh, Gastro could be there keeping a little bit often, but I think it's best for probably to get rid of Terrafly at the moment. As for the Vari, well I can put you in my team here, above here maybe, for now, until then. So there it goes, we got our new member, a uh, new little ancient mythic uh, dragon. Doesn't look so happy, but that's okay, I'll give you some love afterwards. You look cute little baby. And uh, yeah, let's see here. So, oh no, no, it has to be hunting now. That means we can't, uh, we won't be able to use them. So that's that. Surprise. <laughs> anyway, so let's put a U, and I guess I'll remove 
you for now. Wait, hold on. Does that mean I'm going to use TP? That means you're going to... Oh, I have to then use those. So, yeah. So, it doesn't really look like I'm going to be really care about what the personality I'll get for each one of those. So, I'm going to go back to the main adventure. And then we'll be hunting for whatever I get. So, see in a bit once I found my first alpha gleaming in this... Uh, whatever the area I'm at. You know... Since no one else is around... We could pl I can't say anything? I'm not sure if I want to say anything. Can I say anything, game? No, apparently not. Well, that's our first corrupt in this hunt. So fun, but that's okay. Alright, let's see what we got. D-shard, that's fine. And looks like that's the first thing I was able to put. Okay, I was able to get an Alpha Samantha. It looks nice. Cool. Well, we'll see if I can get my hands on one or not. I think that's special, so... I mean, maybe my luck is not that bad good, anyways. I mean, I may still could look for a reason, but sometimes... My luck likes to just kick it up and... Sometimes I just wonder, should I open my mouth that often, or should I close it that often? In some scenarios, maybe it's best for me to not talk. It's the moment you speak. Exactly! Like, the moment I spoke the word, like, I literally just spoke out the word, and I just came at this. Like, what does this happen? Like, sometimes it just... Like, I would say 30% of my times when I do these hunts, it always happens like this. It always do this. Like, for no reason whatsoever, it just happens. For me. Like, to, to like, all people. Like, for all people out there, they selected random people. But for me, it always happens when you least expect it. And it has to be always when I speak. Not sure why, just speak out of the way. But anyways... Now that I also got Scampy, which is a new Lumion I caught, and that'll be a part of the Register, I guess, I guess, so, nice. So let's put you in the Gleaming Box, and move on to the next one. Let's see here, which is that? And then I'm gonna see where's the next Gleaming Box, which is, oh, it's right here, actually, next with the randomized Lumions, which I'll toss it in a different box. Imagine the next one was like just a roaming out of the bat. And some of the other roamings, like Duskin and stuff. Like also like Protagon. Protagon is a machine that is gonna be spawning in the water. And look at that Pyramid! Look at that! Pyramid spawns! Seriously, how do you work? How does this logic work? It makes no sense. And I was and I just spawned the bubble, so. Like, I spotted before it. Yeah, I already spotted even a Bari. But then again, we get the Snorkel one. It's probably, you should be fine. But still, how does these theory works? Ah. Please, Lumi Legacy, fix your theories on it. Like, makes the spawn rates at least understandable. Like, I can say right now... Some Lumions should be obtainable by some parents, and some of these are like small event ones, or at least more the small spawnable ones, especially also like roamings. They should spawn the individual pen of the how they interact. Like, I know Cephalops, the little Cyclops nightmare fuel scorpion thing, obviously would fit perfectly for spawning here, but for like Protagon, Ikazune. Uh, I don't know if Monogon should, I'm not sure if Monogon is waterproof or not, or even if it can sweep, or swim, I'm about to say sweep. <laughs> um, yeah, those ones are not, like, obtainable, I'm not sure they should be allowed to even be in the water, because it makes no sense, as well as some of the other ones, like, that hasn't got the bubble, because we got the bubble, obtain like, around us, like, like, what did they exactly do? Did these rollings just, like, jump in the water as soon as they saw us? Like, oh no, look, there's the trainer. Let's catch him by jumping on this very, very deep water and expect us to be, you know, caught. 
And what happens when we do not want to catch them? Well, that's easy. They drown! Which just makes such a sad and awful way to spawn. Literally, I'm seeing literally a drowned Lumias all around me. You can even picture it on your head. Like, they're seriously all around me as I'm swimming around. <laughs> Why? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. It would be more better. Oh, like, ex yeah. Okay, if I do find an Ikazune, I need to have a chat with that thing or any of the other roamings that makes no sense to be obtainable in this area. If they do spawn. Sure. Now there is an area I do want to check out afterwards, and that is the location where I want to hunt for my next uh, target. Okay, so let's see. So answers to explain explanation explanation. Red foxes are good at swimmers. Red foxes uh, will uh, avoid getting wet, but it's forced. They are able to swim, and there have been act. Accounts of red foxes swimming across rivers or lakes. Typically, though, foxes stay on dry land and the soil. Oh, okay. Okay, so I guess Exuni would make sense they can swim, but breathe on the water? Hmm. Actually, how deep is this water, actually? Let me look at the surface. Let's see here. I mean, the main land is like above there, and it's pretty deep to go down here below, so I don't think the Ikazuna would be uh, having the great lungs to go swim down below, plus its, it's weight would have probably levitated there, so that would have been, I mean, that's not, that's, I don't, no, that would have not able to able to survive that long, and being a fire type will also even possibly hurt it, and look, here's even a crab bush uh, gleaming while I'm speaking about and Igazuna possibly it can spawn in the water. Which shouldn't. As for the, some of the other ones, which makes also no sense, like Protagon being a complete metallic, uh, a metallic, <laughs> a metal t uh, type, which is a, meta a metally fully functioned robot with electricity on side of it, which has literally rust. It will literally rust if it's on the water, pretty sure. So, uh, or actually, is that how it goes? I don't, I don't know if that's, that's theory one or two, but either way. It will not withstand anything. It will literally, like, you know how it happened in the last stream? It exactly would have happened like that. That the protagon who opened that gate inside of the soul heart, or the, that giant pile of rocks, that's exactly what would have happened if it entered the water, like straight off the bat. It would just malfunction and just die. It wouldn't last any, <laughs> any faster than that. So, yeah. Hold on a second. Can robots be waterproof? For example, I'm not allowed to talk, 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 anymore, 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 hello, uh, also, wait, hello, hello, Elphage, actually, you're a good explain, example, you're in, like, what are you, like, a bunch of, you're an electronic being on the water, how do you work, how did you get in on the water, I totally forgot about Elphage, you're just like Protagon. How did you get in the water? 
I'm even looking up proof right now. So, for example, uh, the rating on an IP... Wait, see, see, okay. So, can robots uh, be uh, water resisted? For example, the rating of an IP64 or 67 is quite common amongst the uh, fo uh, foundry robots like the... Okay, blah, blah, blah. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. This means a robot is dust resist and can withstand temporarily a myriad sign of the world. Okay, so they can survive on the border by a chance, but they can't withstand for a very long time. So in other words, robots can go on the water, but it can't withstand, like, it can't be there for a very long time. But then it will be just gone. So they can, okay. But when I run away, <coughs> that just makes it sad because that means I basically letting these roaming just pass away. So in other words, it's better off to catch them right off the bat. Like, don't even take the mercy. Like, you better be picking the mercy. It'll be too deep for them to withstand to hold that long, and eventually, foxes will drown. Which, by the way, hello, Elf H again. I just heard you just a few seconds ago. It is a little annoying, but what can you do about that? Malware. We have a question for you, gamer, for someone. Oh, here's a gleaming single, uh, single, with also defend, uh, defensive, uh, whatever the ability it is. Okay. Okay, and let's try spirit. A uh, gleaming pot monster. And I just took its ability. Uh, let's just throw a hyper disc, and that's that. It's actually wait, hold on. Is that my first one or is it a second one? How come I already have this a capture? If I don't, actually, do I even have one of those before? Oh no, yeah, I did. I did. I did. I, I did catch one of these before. That's right. <laughs> I remember uh, when I did the. A little uh, playthrough thing, which I was like wondering, like, have I actually? I thought it was well, like I, back then. I think it was yesterday when I didn't even know like what this their abilities were, like were the secret ability or not. So that was most common. But anyways, let's continue. Do kind of more like uh, doll mice. I don't get it. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, actually, hold on. When was Tales of and Now think about it. When are they going to actually release it? I mean, we now got the part two thing. So we all know that um, that Tales of Tenoria is going to get its uh, release day. Some point before the next up update in this game. So... Who knows? Also, hi, Mr. Gleaming, uh, so... Samantha? I'm about to say Sabrina for some reason. But, yeah. Hello. Not sure what I'm getting the hiccups for. I should probably drink before I'm getting more hiccups. If I can open this bottle. Yeah, alright, let's move on. It's not that good, but that's fine. At least I got that alpha gleaming.
All right, we only have a few minutes left. So let's see what we can get. Oh, come on! One encounter away, I could've got Dukon. That would be my second best option I could've got him. All right. I mean, it's not that bad. I mean, what possibly could've gotten after that? I mean, it's, it could've been worse. Right? <laughs> oops, oops, wrong button. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, I wonder if I scared anyone. <laughs> I need to also press the right button when I do these soundboards. Um, do I even have it still? Oops. <laughs> but yeah, and I'll, I'll, I'll can. It's very hard for you to see this. Hold on, let me test some of these out. Uh, which one is it? This one? Not exactly, but it does sound per perfect on one of these little encounters. Perfect. <gasps> perfect timing, actually. I got to try the soundboard on this thing. Not exactly what I wanted to obtain it, but you know what? Perfect. I guess that works. <laughs> so that's another single I can, I can uh, evolve. Which, by the way, I'm also going to have to catch and evolve some of these Gleamings to put them as a special Gleaming Index in the future once they do add it. Obviously, if I want to. Right one! Man. Yep, almost a back-to-back. -back. I was going to hope to use the soundboard on one of the, the other ones, but it's fine. So, uh, let's see, how many minutes left? Okay, I have a few seconds left, so let's quickly check that out, and then we'll be... We'll resume from a different area. Should we do that? And also, wait, hold on, hold on! Wait, 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 Lucky wheel, the lucky wheel, hold on! Have anyone seen the lucky wheel yet, actually? Not to think about it. We should probably check that out, if there's anything new there. Is there anything new? No, there's no... Okay, well, that's fun. Okay, I double-checked. I assume there was something at the end of it, then good, I got power points. Yeah, I probably forgot about that. Nobody's actually been talking about it even, so that makes sense, but... Okay. Wait, we at least discovered that there's nothing... <laughs> else there yet but yeah all right all right so let me quickly um look at the uh let's see here let me check the video and see if there's anything suspicious that i'm looking at so let me see here hold on let's see if i can find it uh wait is that it is it right here yeah right right here right here right here right here right here right here so let's see here it should be yeah exactly inside here got it so now Ooh. I can't hold it's so beautiful. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Alright, so there we go. So this is the area what I'm talking about. So this is where Ooh, okay, 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 okay. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Let me just prepare my next boost, but Yeah, this is exactly the area I want to hunt for. For this next Lumion. So this is a one in fifty. And this is the only area I can find this thing. Good to know. So, also, there's something over there I'm going to have to probably claim. So, let's see. What is that over there? It is... Oh, a new ATM. Fade away. Okay. Interesting uh, move, Paul. But, alright then. I um, guess that's it. So, let's uh, just keep hunting until we get something. I'm pretty sure that it's only a 1 at 50, so if I get a gleaming one, then I got a gleaming one. But if I don't, I feel like I should probably catch one of them at least. As a 1 at 50 is a pretty uh, good number for that one. So, uh, I mean, uh, yes, that is better than true. Because, like, I mean, since they were close to the... Uh, since they obviously were done with this part... They should be soon done with Route 8, because 
being taken this long for just a part two it's just stupidly ridiculous which i know they're taking care of the health and all but taking this such long in total it's not even healthy it's just you being lazy so in other words they better make this a route eight possibly not that long i mean they can't take hours or not hours years to for another uh, another uh, another update because it's not an expensive game to play anyways it's just for fun but then again we're not here to eat like we can't live that long like we can't wait for every like once like because like here took they took two to three years for one update and now it's been two to half for this one definitely around there now we're wondering is it gonna be better or is it gonna be worse because like we can't like expect like oh next update it's gonna be four years next update five years and that was just a part one and two and next update it's gonna be 10 years next one is 150 next one is 1 million oh my god what are you doing Jesus we can't uh, live that long I don't know your game is okay and amazing but still you seriously stalling your fans off oh. at this point right now Tales of Tornoys you're pretty much a new Lumin Legacy generation already so we're pretty much moving on and that's it nothing you can do about it you gotta have to kick up the pace and make this anime uh, these uh these games better otherwise it's it's gone nobody even cares nobody even wants to do it Can I get an encounter, please? Okay, there's just a uh, pyramid. Oh, wait, hold on. Oops. I didn't mean to use that. I don't mean to bring an explosion to this party. Okay. Here. Okay, that was not a good video. Okay, whatever. All right, I think I got some of them done. I like War Zero as well. It's a really cool game for me. Um, definitely not do the world that for sure. Um, let me think. Um. Wait, did it just look on one health? Oh well. It's probably nothing. Alright, um... Yeah, I actually don't know if I have a favorite game at the moment. So... Yeah, I don't know. Et so, ladies and gentlemen... Look at here. What would have happened one encounter away after that? I could have got a corrupted Terry pod from this wild area. That could have been something something. And also catching this one because I need one anyways in case I want to just rally one of those anyways. I said anyways twice, now I said it three, four times probably. Alright. Let's just uh, catch this thing and move on to the next one. This is not even an alpha gleaming or even a roaming, but whatever. I'll include it anyways and move on to the next one. And we were 40, uh, 52 encounters away. Mm -hmm. Oh, Stormy said, Stormy Paris said, hi, Luck hey, Luke, hi there, say hi to Pyramide. Actually, you don't have to, you just have to, just, you can just say hi to me, that's fine. 
Well, that, well, that's, let me check it. Let's see. Nope, it's not an essay. I still would not want to make sure I don't want to fail an essay pyramid again. Like, please don't make me regret this. <laughs> and I was 37 encounters away. Could have got a, a pity encounter. Guess that will not happen. Let's continue. Polipi could have been the one. All right, well, let's see here. And the winner will be... Or I'm not winner. Actually, it's just to get... Uh, whatever. Not even going to be good anyways. Watch and learn. No, Samantha. Okay, that's okay. I suppose. I'll take it. I guess. So then it really wasn't really that creative, you know, but whatever. It's better than nothing. So we got a gleaming one instead of the other, but that one used. What did he use? Bait? Alright. Guardian? Alright then, that's fine. Also, the brown, uh, the brown color uh, misprint. So the brown one, like a terror disc, would work perfectly. There it goes. <laughs> okay, I guess it works. Alright, let's move on to the next one. Yep. I knew it. It was terrible. Alright, we'll move on to the next route. Or not route, next location. Oops, no, 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 no. That was meant to be an 8, not a 9. to go for this hunt here but I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna might as well just rally it now until I just get a scam or something wait what I didn't get anything wait I didn't get an encounter here I wasn't even next to a grass encounter or grass pla uh, grass place whatever it calls oh well oh look at that Seems like my theory was right. None of the roamings want to spawn because they are up uh, down there, but this one's actually perfectly. Wait, did I check its ability? Wait, hold on, did it? Wait, wait, I didn't see its ability quick enough. Oh, great. I'm gonna have to catch it, don't I? I didn't see him. I was looking away. I was looking at the video. So I, was, I was focusing on his little comment.
Alright, let's see. What does that say? No, it's not. I had to double check, okay? Well then, here it is! Looks like we found it! I didn't take... Oh, I got it. Yeah, I already... Wait, why do I set it under my own text? <laughs> I finally got it! That is... That didn't take that long, but also, surprise enough, this is what my theory is. It's an immortal the being. I don't know, I'm just going for some stupid stuff. <laughs> so we got our... Our... Seros, El Serios. Not sure how to feel about that name. Kinda similar, similar as Arceus. So nice. Let's see. I'm good. Let's see. No, JK, I'm. Good. Well then, good to know. Alright. Alright. Come on. I'm pretty sure it doesn't learn any uh, special status moves, so I should be good to go. I flame disc. There we go, so I'll try again. Come on! Hold on, my computer wants to turn off. Well, at least I... I hope you... Oh gosh. Oh, wait, adorable. Wait, I haven't seen adorable as it's one of the abilities. Wait a second, is... Did this be an essay? Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. Let me check, let me check, let me check. Is this an essay? Dazed, whatever. I need to see it. Is it an essay or is it just a normal? It could be. Let me give it a look. It is it's essay. Huh. I knew something was very interesting about this. Nice. Well, that's the one way to get that encounter. And let's go on to the next one. Oh! 
Yeah. How many encounters was that from? Wasn't that like a few counters away from getting a pity? Of course. Oh, it's clutch, just the ability. Oh, that's maybe why I led them before. Well, <clears throat> I guess that's one way. All right, that's number nine. All right. Hold on, hold on. I'm trying to see this text, but the screen is not not let me see the full screen. Hold on, hold on. Uh, ah, so oh, gonna we have to clean fully. But yeah, let's move on to the next one. There's like no options for me to deal with. Like I have to rely on actual players out of the world, and that is it. A glass? Yeah. Huh. Well, that's uh, number nine. Yeah. That is a perfect timing. Alright, let me use uh, sharpen, then use spare. I actually even have it on my screen, on my TV, as I'm uh, watching this. I'm literally watching this on my TV and in the game. I might as well have it on my shoulder and then hunt at the same time. Literally, just look at, just listen to me. Listen to me. Oh, ow, no, 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 that's the controller. Hold on. Listen to me. Listen to me. Oh, ow, no, 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 that's the controller. Hold on. Listen to me. Listen to me. Oh, ow, no, 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 that's the controller. Hold on. Listen to me. Listen to me. Oh, ow, no, 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 that's the controller. Hold on. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. <laughs> but you can get it, I guess. <laughs> also, also a nice loop. <laughs> and also, classy, classy, they are. Please stop. I don't want to keep doing this, alright? You get caught once. You don't get caught uh, 300 times later. Yeah, Larry, I just learned how to use Shockwave. Are you surprised about that? What moves can you learn? For me, I can use... I can use Burn Up, a little bit of Shockwave. Uh, I can use... What can else I can use? I can use... I can use Rest sometimes. And that is... Who is that, my brother? Oh yeah, that is definitely him. But yeah. Alright. So, how did it work? Okay. Just double checked. Oh, what the? I just said an R serious gleaming. Not a normal one. And also, hello again. How are you still here? I thought you. I... How? Mm hmm. I don't know. Which also question is R serious or R sir or R C Ross? How do you exactly? How do you exactly, you know, enter this area? You're literally made of fire. You're also a dragon who doesn't breathe over here. So... Are you mortal? Is that the case? Or... What's going on here? Because, uh... I feel like there's a theory that people are going to be asking now in the comments. All I learned is burn up. A range attacking move, but I'm pretty sure it's a melee attacking one anyways. Okay. Have fun. 
Haha, <laughs> I will. Okay, let's see if this one's good or not. By the way, I don't haven't harmonized anything, so if I get something good, I get something good. If not, then it's not good. Does a fire uh, um, made of lava or fire live down here? Certainly not. But for some reason, an ancient uh, ruler, uh, an ancient uh, dragon, the mythical beast. Who is brief uh, absolute uh, destruction and also has a slumber base underneath the water supply. That is a big all no. But some reason Lumi Legacy allows this. Which, by the way, Lumi Legacy. Uh, hello? Are you awake? Literally, are you awake? Let me wake you up. awake now good because now you need to just start actually using your brain of locations sorry I did that one time Sorry, I did it one time. <laughs> Alright, come on now. Chop, chop. Get in the disc. You're paralyzed. You're one health. You can't escape. You have to be caught. Sorcerers, please, just get caught. You're not gonna escape. You're not gonna escape. You're gonna get caught. So just stop uh, stalling and just get caught. Literally. Also, I have a question for myself. Has there any there's a chance there's a, a Lumion that can exhaust herself? That'll be really something they should do if they're not going to stay. And I don't think that's because it's a bad thing or a good thing, but some people obviously think it's a bad thing. But it's just like, come on. We're here to try to do something here, but you're just stalling our time. Come on, man. What's wrong with you? Ugh. I mean, it's fine. I'm not upset too much. And I'm burned. And I'm burned! Just what... Just what Jesus want. Hope he didn't hear me. That one said that. Oh, he just called himself just because I said the word? All right. He meant he heard me say Jesus something, and then he just like. <gasps> I mean. All right. Let's. Uh, I guess I'll put you one of you in a giveaway slot. Yours is a little bit better, I'm pretty sure. And yours is less, so I will put you in the giveaway and move on to the next one. BBK. I don't know exactly what that is. Website is called. But my favorite one's always been my favorite, and that is the, the Tally Tubbies. Nope. And I'm ashamed about saying it. I might actually watch it. I think even there's actually. Wait, actually, aren't they like included in Netflix now? I don't know. Oh yeah, Harris said another one. Wait, why is there another one here? Huh, ah, oh well. Yeah, that's right, that's okay, so let's go for a sharp myth first. Because I need to I get more attack damage and then I can spare afterwards. See if this thing wants to use slumber. Actually hold on, doesn't this learn slumber at level 45? Maybe that's the Oh maybe that's oh okay. So maybe those uh those time those the uh, roamings were only available by okay, I think I understand that. Okay, 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 okay. So it should be fine. This thing should not learn slumber because I'm pretty sure it only learns by a level cap, maybe. But yeah. Okay, by the way, if this one's good, I'll keep it. So, 
Also, by the way, if you don't know the, which one is the difference, uh, Glacida, Glacidia is the uh, frost one, which is possibly, if I've been looking at it, obviously not clearly, um, this one is ice and range attacking of a type. As for the other one, it's a fire and also it's a melee attacking of the kind. So, there's one range attack and one melee attack. But this range because I would have been like, wait, what are the better if there's melee attack and then range attack? Doesn't matter. Oh my god, it went out of its bubble. So it looks like so uh Dakura has already been revealed as the soul burst where someone is gonna reveal it. Wait, what happened? Ragoon, wait wait, wait why did you faint? Oh my gosh, did I look away again? It must have failed to be by a crit. Also, Vespa 2, you're here for just to heal and stall it in case it's gonna keep using its move. Glassy. Glass had the. Uh, okay, okay. Can I just call it glass? Just like pure glass? I'm gonna call it glass, because it's a little bit easier to say it, its full name. RC and glass. Accepted apparently. Uh, haven't uh, you heard about this uh, in the India animation called the Amazing Digital Circus? I don't know what this uh, show is about, but uh, let me know if I've uh, heard that song before. It's Zoo Bele. Someone has been banned. Oh, that didn't take that long. And also, wasn't that a pity of way? Or maybe not. I don't know. Anyways, that's not SA. And let's catch it and move on to the next one. Unless, uh, obviously, this one wants to not be. Oh, wait, hold on. This one isn't even pity. So that means I can't get it to pity anymore. I even spelled it how the how she spelled or how her name is, so you can take it from the title. Also, looks like we've done that quest done, and uh, looks like we have done that. And now let's just uh, run around until we find something random. If not, hope you enjoy. Actually, I include that still at the end of the video. Let's see what I got. Yeah, I'm actually gonna say like some of these characters are a little bit not sure if they're much of my favorite i would say right here from like the bottom to the top bubbles is probably my least favorite character hasn't really got too much on the show uh, it doesn't really got them too much of a character and it's just simply just been just been popping around all over the place next one is probably zubo she's okay but it's not like she she just hasn't got too much characteristic in the show and she's been the uh, Quite down recently, but she has been honest a little bit often and there and there. Next one is uh, Kane, sixth place, pretty sure. Um, he's a little bit odd one, literally. It's trying to be cool and all, but honestly, he feels. I feel like he's just the main villain in there. He's just trying to trick his friends into just. He wants to just everyone to stick in their void, and yeah, that's it. I'm pretty sure that's the main villain line. Next one is the Gango. She's cute. She's kind of cute at the first. She's okay. She's nice and she's adorable at first, but then her mask breaks and then she's just like, she just keeps crying and they're just like, yeah, I don't know about that. She just, no. It's, it kind of ruins the whole thing. Up next is probably everyone's uh, most uh, likable one, but I, I mean, not the most, it's like a bad character, but still has a pretty enjoy entertainment one. It's Rakatha. 
Frankenstein is okay. She has, actually has a all right uh, personality, and actually by far the most normal, normalistically character of all of them. But never got to show much, uh, show so much into the show ever since she got glitched, and that's really all she's ever been there from there. Uh, the next one is probably everyone's uh, most alive, lovable ca character, Kinger. The one who's a chess piece who just loves to be like, who just say uh, he's a little bit cuckoo, let's just say that. But also still uh, hilarious at some point, like, ah! Like that moment just made everyone laugh. <laughs> and I still like Kinger, it's a pretty funny character and I love it. And I also had some good easter egg with him. Up fifth, uh, second place is Pomni for me. She's been okay. I mean, even for a main, a new character or a main character, she's all right. But she doesn't really did have that. I mean, she's okay, but she's trying to just basically just escape and all. But I just don't find her too much. Well, not that most. It's, she's not that most experienced, the most uh, favorable one for me. But I just feel like she's just trying to be the best, uh, trying to actually understand the the whole situation she's at like she's actually stuck in there the whole purpose of being inside of a, a digital game is like or digital world is like bruh she, she just really feels bad like the other ones pretty much accepted it but for Pomni she has to just she's already at episode one this is already gonna go insane a little bit so that's one thing I just liked about her a little bit but still we just all rooting for her, Pomni to be okay and first place is obviously Jax. He's humor, he's lovable, and he's just trying to trying to make his friends uh, just to, you know, stay as normal as possible. Even though technically Jax is like a character who's already accepted his life, and he's even like, he hasn't even gone insane a little bit. He's just trying to understand that, he's just trying to like be one of the, his uh, friends, just, just like, like he's, he's just a normal, natural, funny man who's just been inside of a bunny suit, just, or a bunny character. And he just doesn't really care. He just loves to do what he, what he likes. Just like us. We just love to do stuff what we like. And that's what Jax is. And for uh, his, his amazing smile. I'm not going to put the audio. going to get claimed. And yeah. It just. Let's just be real. Would you like to. Uh, would you girls like to have a. Uh, alone time with him? <laughs> Okay, maybe not. Maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let me not <laughs> stop. All right, all right. Let's... <laughs> but anyway, that's me. That's that. What's a gloink? I got it. It was gloink. <laughs> oh, what? Man, Zubal is really into the swears. <laughs> yeah, if you ever need me, then <laughs> off. Like, seriously, just shut the <laughs> off of you guys. Huh? Wait, why did I get censored? I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> King of you? <laughs> King of you, mother! <laughs> Sorry, I know all the reference, so I know how everything ends and starts. Okay, now see, <laughs> perfect timing, but I'm not gonna include all of it. I will include a little bit. So hello, corrupt. You might, I might have gone insane a little bit, but now you're making me go a little insane. <laughs> kind of like you guys. You guys are making me a little insane when you guys are not commenting, liking, subscribing, and watching my videos and stuff like that. That's also keeping me insane. <laughs> so what are you guys doing anyways? So what are you guys doing for a living? Whatever. Anyways, moving on. And then I can start with the Digital Circus little character arc. One I promised you all. And that is an essay before we're about to end it. You're not alpha gleaming either, Lalamba. I want you to be alpha gleaming with an essay. That's one of my goals, at least. One. Okay, where's the Modigons? I need to 
I need to uh, put it back into the right box. There it goes. Yeah. It's gonna be one of those, so yeah. Alright, let's go ahead now and the, 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 the little thingy.